Monologue from Wink by Phoebe Claire Powell. When Dad died, he had this shit blog he was really proud of. Before Tumblr was even a thing. And you would have thought he'd invented space travel or something. Because he was beaming for days. Going upstairs to put another post on. Gotta keep my views up, son. And he'd look at me like, see, we understand each other. But I told him that no fucker in my right mind wanted to know about middle-aged running clubs. And he said, that's where you're wrong, son. That's where you're oh so wrong. You'd say that a lot. And try not to let me get to him. Because for some reason, I used to like to undermine him, even though I loved him. When he signed up for the London Marathon, he linked it to his just giving page. It was like he landed on the moon. Mum said it was unfair for someone so fit to just drop down dead. And a friend said, it's always the one you least expect. And I told her to go fuck herself, in my head, and not out loud. Because everyone looks at you really hard when it's your father's funeral. Sharon did a lot of fainting, which was annoying. Uh, Mum kept holding my hand saying, thanks for keeping it together, we need you to keep us all together. And so I decided I wasn't going to be what they needed. On Facebook, there are people that make pages for dead ones, relatives, pets. Mum said I should put a post on his blog to tell people what had happened. They need to know, she said. They're not pen pals, Mum, it's not how it works. They'll just think he gave up blogging for a bit. And I rolled my eyes at her for a full stop. But sometimes I did check it, just to see if they had any more views. Then I realised I was the one making the counter go up. 